The artist behind Keep Building Jackson is hoping to have his work permanently displayed here in the capital city, but he needs some help from the community to make his dream become a reality. Governor Santa Ferry spoke with the man behind this unique art. Whole display with me in it. Um, as it last was seen. For years, longtime Lego lover Scott Crawford has put the city of Jackson on display for the holidays. Um, there's the standard life building that has about 30,000 bricks. By making real life buildings miniature. It, it, it's supposed to be fun and entertaining for the holiday season. And it's also supposed to inspire people to care about the real city. One thing I've noticed is that when people see Jackson buildings in miniature, they all of a sudden appreciate the real ones. And it's an interesting effect. <laughs> so um, I appreciate the real ones too. And so I try to recreate them as best I can. Okay, so you have monsters, do you have superheroes? Oh, of course. Yeah, <laughs> that was like the first thing that I, I added. Unfortunately, due to the pandemic and the progression of Crawford's multiple sclerosis, 2019 was the last year his work was on display. For the 10 years that I did it, it got bigger and bigger and bigger every year. I, I had to outdo myself <laughs> from the next year, you know. And by, by 2019, it took a month to set up. And my disease is progressing to the point where I no longer have the stamina to do that whole month of work and then monitor it you know, three and four days a week and show people around. And, and the effort to talk is, is just, it's enormous for me. Crawford says his dream is to create a foundation that would permanently allow his Lego legacy to be enjoyed by everyone. To create a case, a glass case for it, so that I can set it up in a public place in Jackson where everyone will enjoy it and it will be safe from tampering and safe from, you know, dust and it will be lower maintenance because right now it's really high maintenance. <laughs> David Lewis with the city of Jackson is not only a Lego collector himself, but a fan of Crawford's work. He says to have a display like this in Jackson would be unique, but the project needs funding. If the community can really rally around it or a foundation can come in and support it or even a crowdfunding campaign can launch, that can move the dial a lot faster and it allows for there to be better maintenance and structures in place for the upkeep of that. We want to make sure that that has a long life forever. I want people to enjoy it. I want it to make people happy and I want it to inspire people to make a better world. And Make a better world starting with Jackson. Crawford says because of his disease, he will eventually lose the ability and strength to set up his display. He hopes the funding for the case will come through before that happens. In Jackson, Anna Farish, 12 News. And Scott Crawford, he is a true treasure. Thank you, Anna, for doing this story. If you'd like to contact Scott about his display or possible funding, you can reach out to him on his Facebook page, Keep building Jackson.